Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel at Second International. This is your visa advisor. Today I am going to take a mock interview in the US. Like you all know that in the past few days I have been preparing a mock interview on the F1 visa and F1 visa. And you all have liked that video very much and appreciated it in the comments. So I will tell you that I am going to take a tourist visa. And I have been preparing a tourist visa for the first time. So I am going to take a tourist visa for the first time. So, those who want to go to the United States on a tourist visa and this year their plan is or they have taken their visa appointment or they are going to be just going to be an interview so this video is going to be very beneficial for you But before starting with this video I want to request you that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe the channel like this video and of course do share it with your friends as well And it's not enough if you want to apply for your visa we will apply for your visa whether it is a tourist visa or a visitor visa student visa, J1 visa or any other country visa, just feel free to WhatsApp on this number. And if you want to take an interview preparation, whether it is any visa category related, it means that B1, B2 visa category, J1 category, F1 visa category or any other visa category, just feel free again to WhatsApp on this number. And if you want to take any services from them, just give them a number on the bottom of the number on WhatsApp. इतना ही नहीं अगर आप J1 वीजा कैंडिडेट हैं या फिर F1 वीजा कैंडिडेट हैं एंड यू पीपल आर लुकिंग फॉर द मॉक इंटरव्यूज रिलेटेड टू योर वीजा टाइप तो मैं इन दोनों वीडियोस का लिंक डिस्क्रिप्शन में मेंशन कर दूंगी या फिर कहीं आई बटन में होगा तो आप जाके चेक कर सकते हैं एंड उन वीडियोस को देख सकते हैं एंड अपना फ्यूचर ब्राइट कर सकते हैं एंड वीजा ऑफिसर से अप्रूवल पा सकते हैं सो वेल फाइनली आफ्टर ऑल दीज थिंग लेट्स डाइव इन द वीडियो आज मेरे साथ मेरे कैंडिडेट हैं शी इज माई कैंडिडेट एंड आज ये एक्ट करने जा रहे हैं एज अ टूरिस्ट वीजा एप्लीकेट And I am there as a visa officer today once again. So, chale karte hain video ko start. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning. Pass me your passport and your itinerary. Good morning. Okay, so what is the purpose of your trip? What is the purpose of your trip? The purpose of my visit is tourism. So where are you going in the United States? I'm going to visit different places there like Florida, Los Angeles, San Diego, New York City and uh, California. And How long is this trip? It is a 10 days long trip. When is this trip going to start? It is going to start in June month. Who is accompanying you? Uh, no one. And who is sponsoring this trip? Uh, my father. What is the annual income of your father? It is... Uh, I don't know. What is the source of income of your father? My father runs a business. Why did you select this particular time for your trip? Um, actually, I am a school teacher and I will get summer holidays. That is why I will go on this trip. How will you manage your accommodation? I will stay in hotel. Do you have any relatives in the United States? No. Are you married or unmarried? Unmarried. Did you have any international travel before? No. Can you name some of the places where you will visit during your trip? Yes, it is Florida, California and Los Angeles. Discuss your travel plan in detail. That how many days will you spend where? I will spend two days in Los Angeles. 
five days in San Diego and uh, four days in what Canada. is your intention behind this trip I just want to explore different places have you visited to any other country no how can you show me that you'll return back to your country I will definitely return back I will definitely return back now Try next time. So this was a tourist visa mock interview. I hope you learned so many things out of this. But I want to highlight here a few mistakes which the candidate has done. And you might have also observed those mistakes. So the first very big mistake which this tourist visa applicant has done that is when I asked that girl that what is the purpose of your trip she was quite nervous. I asked the second time also then she was able to reply but otherwise she was quite nervous so I must suggest you here that if you don't feel comfortable there if you are nervous just take a long deep breath and then listen to the question and answer to the question properly so the second mistake she did that was she didn't know about the sponsor income obviously as per her saying her father is going to sponsor her for this tourist visa but she was not aware about the annual income of her father which is again a second big mistake because if someone is sponsoring you you must have all the information regarding the source of income of your sponsor and the annual income as well well before moving to the third point I want to highlight here that if you people are looking for the any interview sessions you want to prepare yourself for the interview so that you can get the approval from the ambassador then you have to do one thing that is what's up on this number I know you can be from different visa categories it might be F1 J1 B1 B2 then don't forget to WhatsApp because we provide all the interview sessions well so the third point was that when she was explaining her travel plan you must have observed that I have asked that applicant number of times that where she plans to go but every time she was saying the name of the places but it was not in the order she was not able to convince me she was not able to describe that where she gonna start for her trip and where she gonna end that trip and what she gonna do in between that and most importantly she was unable to describe the destinations she has planned to visit in the United States during her trip the third mistake was she didn't describe me about the destination she has planned to visit during her trip. So she should mention that as well. And the fourth mistake was that whatever she has answered that was too short. I was expecting some lengthy explanation that what is there in her mind. But she was unable to express herself maybe due to the nervousness or due to the lack of confidence. But whatever the situation was, whatever the reason was, the visa officer always expect a clear and a transparent explanation from the applicant so that he can make the decision accordingly. So these are few mistakes which she has done during her interview. Otherwise, it was a mock interview. So don't just repeat these mistakes. And not only this, if you want to make a video on this topic, so don't forget to comment under this video because I read your comments a lot. And I feel good and when you comment, I always try to make such videos. And not only this, if you have any services that you need from them, whether it is a visa application, a slot booking, an interview preparation, or any services that you need from them, then you can give us a WhatsApp number. My team will definitely reward you. They will call back you or they will text back you. Whatever situation will happen, we will revert you and you will solve all your problems. So if you like this video, please like this video quickly and share this video quickly. So if you like this video, please like this video quickly and share this video quickly. So if you like this video, please like this video quickly and share this video quickly. So if you like this video, please like this video quickly and share this video quickly. So if you like this video, please like this video quickly and share this video quickly. ये वीडियो शेयर करना बिल्कुल मत भूलना सो हेर आई वुड लाइक टू एंड दिस वीडियो थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग दिस वीडियो सो स्टे फिट एंड स्टे हेल्दी